good day everybody welcome to my youtube channel i am isabel and thank you so much for tuning in today we're going to be doing a little mini uh, perfume collection haul as well as a mini purse and a card holder haul as you can hear in the background my daughter is having a time of her life <laughs> So uh, hopefully she does not disturb us, but she's just playing. Oh no, she's opening the volume. Oh, no. Okay, let's get to it guys. So I'm going to start with the perfume haul. So this the first perfume we've got Michael Kors Mystic Shimmer. This perfume is so nice it is so sweet oh guys like am i gonna get through this video or should i just stop right here Zaza? Valley volume, eh? Good care, Valley volume, Nana. Good girl. Good girl, me. Eh? Okay, where was I? All right, Michael Kors Mystic Shimmer. This perfume is. This perfume is the girl. She thinks she is. Oh my God. Okay, by the way, I like sweet, floral, summery perfumes and this is exactly that. It smells so good. Oh, it smells so good. It's got like a caramelly, rosy-like flowery smell. Like I can't even explain it. It is so, so good. This is one of my favorite perfumes. Actually, all of the perfumes I have are my favorite because they all smell so wonderful. So this is one of the perfumes there you go the michael Kors mystic shimmer mm. perfect and then for number two we have giorgio armani there you go giorgio armani i don't know if it's pronounced the c or sai or I don't know, but SI, Giorgio Armani SI, Giorgio Armani C. This perfume, I don't wanna lie, in the beginning, you know, this perfume, I just, it wasn't doing it for me. The first time I smelled it, it had like an old age home type of smell, like very old, or let me just say, very mature smell. But now, like, like it smells different when it's on my skin. Like, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Like, it smells, it smells so good. Like, almost like the the the, the Michael Kors Mystic Shimmer. But this one, it has a bit of a musky like smell as well. Oh, it's so good. It's so good. It's also very sweet. It's got that sweet smell. Like, like I said, I love sweet, florally kind of smell. I'm a girly girl like that. And then we have another perfume. This one, I've I haven't opened it yet, but I've been using the testers. So this is the Michael Kors Gorgeous. Michael Kors Gorgeous for the gorgeous, gorgeous girls and. I must say it is oh i've been using it all the time like i don't know where i put my little um it's not a tester it's just a little perfume that comes with um well that comes in with this bigger perfume so it comes in like a, a box with this perfume the little smaller perfume that can you that can fit in your handbag and a lotion so it comes as a set so you, this one I haven't used yet. I've been using the lotion and I've been using the smaller perfume and I've been smelling like a gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous girl these past few days, weeks. Like, oh, this perfume is just, yeah. It's it's also part of my favorite. Like, like I said, all of these perfumes are actually all my favorites because 
they all have that distinct sweet smell that I love and yeah so Michael Kors gorgeous is definitely the girl she thinks she is okay and then this perfume oh, this perfume is so sentimental to me I've had this perfume guys it's close it's going to three years like can you believe it like do perfumes even expire is there an expiry date on this thing because it's been almost three years I got this perfume from a special somebody yeah it's a Britney Spears I don't know I don't know Britney Spears what I don't know what it's called I can't even remember because the box is long gone but it's oh it's it's a beautiful sweet soft smell it's it's oh it's just the base and it's almost it's all it's like over here it's quarter to finishing and i haven't been using it much because i'm trying to preserve it as much as i can but it looks like this it comes in a container like this it was also a set so it was this big one and a little uh, a little one that one i put in my car and tip guys never ever leave perfume in your car especially when it's summer and it's hot because that perfume will evaporate i learned it the hard way my little perfume i always kept it in the car and jiggy jiggy one day perfume was finished i was like honey, because i haven't been using it that much Kanti, it's been evaporating it's been evaporating into thin air so try and i don't know take the perfumes out or put them in your bag so that when you get out of the car you come out with the perfume in the bag because if you leave it in the car and your car is out for long hours in the sun it will evaporate mm. just a tip yeah? a fyi and then my other one Ooh. guys i've also had i think i've had this one as long as i've had the britney spears one like i'm obsessed and usually when i buy perfumes or get perfumes likely me uh likely for me i usually get them in sets so this one was also in a set i haven't thrown away the the, <laughs> the container of the other one so it was a set like this the smaller one and the big one and then a lotion the lotion is long gone finished thrown away but i'm still holding on to this i'm such a hoarder guys i need to throw it away because it's empty but this one as you can see there's still a bit of perfume in there so this is dng this is dolce and gabbana dng Ooh, this smell guys on a hot day like ah, i am telling you like this is the scent this is the scent like oh it's got that sweet mess uh that sweet smell but then it's in a this it's strong yana it's got the stronger smell to it you are this one this one this one guys this one is the black dng uh when this one finishes i'm definitely going for another one because dng is the base like on a hot summer day you know the girls are going out like this is this is the perfume this is the perfume guys i'm telling you okay and then i've got another one which is michael Kors. you'll probably think i'm crazy about michael Kors, but i really love michael Kors perfumes because usually the scents of sweet the, 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 the scents that i like this one i also haven't used guys i haven't used this one it came like the other one it was also like the big perfume and then the mini perfume for the handbag and then the lotion here's the lotion i haven't used the lotion as well the lotion looks like this michael kors collection i haven't used the perfume i haven't used the lotion oh this is the perfume michael kors collection and i haven't used it but uh, I think the smell has to grow on me just like the Giorgio Armani because now you know who go like you know who matured lady you know 
in her 60s or 70s but maybe when it's on my skin because like i said sometimes this this the, the scents smell differently when they on your skin because not to like we bring out some sort of odor and when those two combine it's just like a whole new scent but this one i still have to grow into i think maybe that's why i haven't used it because i probably smelt it and i was like But I will try it soon and I think I'll probably will like it as well because perfumes like I said they do smell tend to smell differently when you um when they come into contact with your skin right so another tip guys when I usually spray these perfumes um I don't spray them alone a lot of people will say they combine the perfumes which is great it's like that is wonderful and create their own perfumes what I do this is a plug I don't know if you all will use it or not but excuse me but what I usually do is I will um, bath and everything put on my lotion that I use and then I will go in with this spray here. Yeah, when it says they are pale food because like I use it, like I use it a lot. So it's the also heavenly uh, sensations viva la vanilla body spritzer. Like I love it. This is the only flavor um, that I go for. This is the only scent that I go for, and I think it is perfect because, like I said, I'm into that um, sweety, um, florally scent. This is vanilla. So when this mixes with all those other perfumes that I showed you, which are mostly sweet based, it just it. like it just oof, you smell so good and the perfume lasts longer so the tip is to spray on um your pulses so it will be here it will be on your palms it will be behind your knees it will be by your um by your ankle and then you know you just all over on the hair as well i've noticed that usually when i uh, um, put on e deodorants usually my wigs or the wig that i'll be wearing on that day will like, carry on smelling like the perfume i used for days so also on that weave girl like just you know just so that you can smell good and yeah those are my perfume collection guys and then i got this one as well this one guys this is fake by the way this one is fake the, all the others they are real but this one is fake i just bought a fake one so that i could kind of sense how long it would last the quality of the perfume as well so this is sweet daisy it's by I'll probably write I'll write it down there it's by but it's sweet daisy this is quite a, also a popular perfume it smells so good I don't want to lie this was like 80 rand or something it smells so good now you want to say a pella no pella guys like this is a perfume I put on when I'm just going to buy bread you know just muting the sink or just see a in your wear manja type of thing and it's so nice it's so nice it's so nice it's just that it does not last long oh it doesn't last long but it is so nice it smells so good it was 80 rand a small street and yeah i've been using it when i go run my errands like close to home so guys those were my perfumes i'm still going to add more to them i know i think i'm getting addicted but a girl can never have enough perfumes right so now we're moving on to my purses Ooh, i got quite a few purses so yesterday i was at the mall and i went to fashini and i happened to buy um some little purses and card holders i'm a huge 
huge huge fan of Colette like I'm a huge fan of Colette like I swear by Colette. You know, I love Colette handbags. I love Colette purses. I love Colette card holders. I love Colette like the quality. Like you get a photo when I see Usisi man. Like you know, you become dignified in a way. <laughs> I love Colette bags and Colette purses. So I got this cute white, simple, plain Colette. Hers. It's just written Colette by Colette Heyman. Um, it's got a zip. It's a zip. It's got a zip there on the side. To put your coins. It's got a place for your cards. And then there's also a place to put your paper notes in there. Guys. <laughs> I did mention in the beginning that my daughter is sitting with me and she's having a time of her life. Uh, she's watching Coco Melon and if you hear her singing or commenting, please don't mind guys, okay? So this is the pair, this is the purse, sorry. Very cute, very cute, very cute. I just need a white, white toilet handbag to go with it. It was 200 grand. This was 200 grand, guys. I love it so much. And then I got this other Colette uh, card holder as well. This one is a bit different. There you can put your cards in there. And the price it was 100 Rand. It looks like this. It's quite tiny. It's also written Colette by Colette Heyman. This is this is a very nice purse. I love it. I bought a black one so that it could go into my black handbags. You know, like I want like I want my handbag to match my purses, that type of thing, match my outfit. Like I just want to look put together. You understand? So I bought that black one, and this one I bought a while ago actually. And I realized yesterday that I bought the same thing. I guess I like that style, but this one is in nude. So I bought this one in nude. It's the same thing. Cards go in there. And then, yeah, it's really tiny. It can fit into a miniature bag. Uh, let's see. The other one that I got is by Luella. Luella. This one is by Luella. It's very cute as well. I love it so much. This one is quite bigger. As you can see, you can open it up there. You can put coins in there in the zip compartment there. You can put your paper notes in here. You can even put lip gloss in here. Um, and then there's a zip at the back where you can put some coins as well. And then yeah, this is very cute, I love it. It's by Luella Hoshini. And this one was 180 grand. And then I just wanted to show you another one that I got a while ago. It's also by Colette Heyman. I just want to show you how cute it is. Like, and the sizing is just perfect for those miniature handbags that you like to carry. This one I'm already using. So, there you go. My cards are in there already. It's Colette by Colette Heyman. This is a card holder. Very cute, guys. Very cute. Very cute. Very tiny. And I love the print as well. So this goes with a black bag, goes with a nude brown bag, goes with a white bag, goes with a gray bag. This one just goes with all the bags. So like I'm still collecting guys. I want some more. Like I want a red one. I want I want a gray one and then I want a proper sized like purse. I already have them, but I want like if not like a proper like Malfigan Dawin guys and you have to pay the bill or you have to like bring out your purse you, you know you know like 
you can't be making them coins and not having a proper bag to put those coins inside the Antola. so that's what i want i'm still gonna buy that uh, i want like a really like cute cute purse so i'll get that i'm still looking they didn't have anything a collette that i liked so maybe if i go in a few months time they'll have new stock or something so guys i think that is it like we managed to survive even with my daughter in the background we managed to survive through this vlog what is it is it a haul or a vlog i think it's a haul right so guys thank you so much for watching up until this far i hope you like i hope you subscribe i hope you press that notification button so that you are notified each time i upload a video thank you so much for watching guys we'll see you on the next video bye